Hi honeys, it's Michelle, and I'm here today to open up my second Trunk Club box. The way the Trunk Club works is for $25 a box, they send you quite a few items. I think it's eight to 10 items, and you decide what you wanna keep. You send back what you don't. You don't have to pay for shipping either direction. And if you keep anything, the $25 is deducted from what you keep. So it's pretty easy to work with them. And they give you five days to go through your box and see what you want to keep. So mine came in a box that looks like this today. And everything comes wrapped individually. I do have a different stylist this time. Her name is Kelsey. She put some outfits in here, she said. And now she, they do send you a preview. So anything that you don't like, you can delete or change. And I, I did change a few things. It seems to be a very white or a white and blue theme. Also, there's a little bit of gold in the box. And I try to stick, I, I, I try to do this little theme every summer where I've got certain colors I'm kind of going for what my mood is and I think I'm probably sticking with something similar to what I did last summer which is I'm wanting to do kind of this turquoise color white navy kind of an ocean side feel so it's kind of like she read my mind <laughs> She also says that you can add up to three add-on pieces. So that's good to know. I don't know if I did. I don't think I did. Okay, and it was 10 items that they sent me. So let's get started. So here's the first item here. It's a dress. It's a white t-shirt dress with navy stripes and it's got a rounded hem on it and then it's got a v-neck at the top i do love t-shirt dresses <sighs> this is by caslon it's a 1x it's made in india the price tag on here says 49 dollars. one thing i've discovered that i really like about trunk club when things go on sale at nordstrom's <laughs> when you if you look at the app on your phone if it's on sale you get the sale price so hypothetically speaking, if this was half off, it'd only be $25 instead of $49. And I love that because a lot of the other boxes that I've received don't do that. Things never go on sale and you have to pay full price all the time. Now it looks like you can really kind of see through it. I don't know if you can see what I'm talking about. We'll see if you can see my bra and panties through this. <laughs> but it has that oceanside nautical feel that I'm going for. Okay, the next item is another dress. And I think this is so pretty. We'll see what it looks like on, but it's Vince Camuto and it's a tie front dress with spaghetti straps. So it's, palm, it's a palm print tie front dress, Vince Camuto, extra large, ivory, $69. Isn't it pretty though? It feels so summery to me. <laughs> it feels like one of those dresses that would just be great for date night, going out for dinner, maybe having a drink or two. It also feels like the perfect vacation dress, although it looks like it does wrinkle really easily. So it might be difficult to take on vacation. Is there lining in here? Let's see. There's no lining in here, which I actually don't like lining in dresses, <laughs> but you tend to be able to see right through them though too. So we'll see. And I'm sorry about my air conditioner. It's gonna be coming on and off the whole time, but I live in Vegas. I'm in the desert. It's, is it summer yet officially? I don't know, but it's, almost here if it's not. Last time I looked, it was, it was only 92 today, but it's been in the hundreds almost every day for the last week. So this is 100% rayon, but you can wash it in the, in the washing machine. 
oh wow you got to wash it separately and then line it dry but I'm pretty impressed that you can actually machine wash a rayon dress <laughs> okay <laughs> the next item and I'm 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 curious to see how this is gonna fit it's probably not gonna fit just to forewarn you but it's so cute I hope it fits it is <laughs> 90s short overalls by City Chic. It's an 18 in blue, $89. I love overalls and I never wear them because I've got an hourglass shape and I just don't think that overalls tend to look good. It feels like it thickens the waist, but depending on how they're cut, they don't. And depending on what you wear underneath them. But I've always wanted to have a cute pair of overall shorts. I hope they're cute, but I don't think they will be. And the reason I say that is these aren't stretch. And I was hoping they would be, but they're not. But we'll find out. There's a little bit of distressing here on the front of each leg. And then down at the bottom, there's a frayed hem, which I'm all about. I like frayed hems more than cuffs. I feel like cuffs are so much maintenance. I have to constantly make sure that they're cuffed right and... <laughs> So we'll see, but if these do fit and they are cute, it's probably going to be my uniform all weekend or all weekend. <laughs> It'll probably be my uniform all summer long. <laughs> oh, okay. I don't know about these either. Well, I mean, we'll find out. That's part of why I do this though. I get to try things that I would never try on if I saw in the store. I just wouldn't. Okay. This is Wit and Wisdom in a 1X and it's a pair of rayon shorts. They have a distressed bottom on them with about an inch and a half slit on the sides. And they've got pockets on the back and on the front. I just don't see how these are going to fit me. I can almost guarantee they won't. I tend to be more of a size 18 on the bottom and a 16 on the top. And these are a 1X. I don't know how they could possibly fit. They're machine washable though, which is nice. They're 100% polyester. Okay, to me, yeah, because to me they've got that real linen rayon look to them. But also, I could not wear these at home. The reason I say that, Zelda and Marty are both lap cats. So anything I wear at home, they're going to need. And this would be a train wreck for cat nails. But I'm going to see if I can, you know, get them over my buns to at least show you. Now, this one I did pick. They had something else selected, and I thought, you know, I don't want that. I think that it was the same one, but in white. And I thought, a white chiffon top is just screaming to have mustard spilled all down the front of it. <laughs> but I thought, if I wore this... I wouldn't have to worry about it. I love black tank tops. I love how it's so easy to mix and match them with a bunch of different things. This one is, it says a small size 16. This must be like a plus size only brand or something. It says City Chic. I thought they made um, standard size tops. But anyway, this is a nice flowy chiffon top and it is two layers this is the perfect date night top I think okay the next thing that I have here it seems like rayon is super in this year doesn't it so this is a rayon dress it's striped I think it's so cute it's like a timeless look it's Caslon. The price on it is $69. Oh, I like this. And it's got a belt that comes with it. It buttons down the front. And it's a V-neck, which I really like. It's got a high-low cut on the hem. And it's got this fun little detail here where over on the side of each hip, the stripes go sideways instead of up and down. So we'll see how it looks. I, 
I hope that it looks amazing, but <laughs> this, this is the kind of thing I would never try on though. Well, this is interesting. So it's got a hole on the side for the belt. I guess so the belt doesn't have to go across the back or so it doesn't have to go across the front. Do you know? I don't know what that means. It's also got pockets. Okay. And what you're all probably wondering, okay, so it's 55% linen, 45% rayon. Machine wash again. <laughs> okay. Then there's a city chic wrap dress in a size 16. You know, not wrap dress, wrap shirt. So it's got these cute, what do you call these? Sleeves on it <laughs> with the elastic at the end. And it is a true wrap top, which I love. So we'll see how it looks. It's so cute. Very wrinkly though, so it's definitely going to be something that has to be steamed. It's 100% viscose on the outside and the lining is 100% cotton. And this, this is a hand wash item. And the lining is across the bust on the inside. So we'll see. We'll see. And I think this one might be for sale because the price is crossed out on it. Is it on here? <laughs> on here, it's got the full price. Now, on the app, it might not, but it says it's $59 for the top. It's so pretty, though. I love these golden polka dots. <laughs> I've been noticing watching YouTube, a lot of people don't like stripes. A lot of people don't like polka dots. A lot of people don't like flowers. You know, they're, they just kind of want... I'm the other way around. I love it all. Throw all the different patterns you can at me. All the bright colors. I love it. Okay, we have another white dress. I think white is really in this year. Because <laughs> I've been seeing it in magazines a lot and just everywhere. It's like people are wearing a lot of white and they're wearing a lot of rayon. And So this is a white rayon dress. It's city chic. It says ivory in a small... Isn't this cute though? I love the sweetheart neckline. And there's the back of it. It buttons down and it does have a lining in it. Let's see. So it says the outside is 55% linen, 45% cotton, and the lining is 100% cotton. You can machine wash this. In fact, it says to wash separately in the washing machine before you wear it and then line dry it. And you can iron it, it says. And that dress is $99. I bet, yeah, that makes sense though with it being rayon. Rayon's always expensive. And here's <laughs> a necklace that I decided to select because I thought it was so cute. Yeah, pretty it's just very simple but I like that I like how it's ivory and then it's got just the plain rectangular little box at the bottom and this is $28 by Madewell I can't believe this my nail just fell off and I don't know where it is and I don't know why it fell off either. That's bizarre. I hope I find it. <laughs> Otherwise I have to go and have a whole new nail put on. Because I don't do them myself. I do them at a salon. So it's going to be fun to have to deal with. If... Huh. I don't know. Anyway. I'll keep you up uh, posted if I find the nail though. I don't see it so far. And the worst part is, I don't know when it came off, unless it was when I was looking at one of these dresses. It had to have been then. Last item is the Dea Slingback Sandal by Steve Madden in gray, $59.95. And they're a size 10, because I got big feet. 
Are they gray though? Okay, they're not gray. As I say, I thought I ordered gold. <laughs> Now, I did tell them I'm a 10 wide, but these don't look wide to me. They're so cute, too. I hope that they fit, but I don't think they will. <laughs> and these are nice and cushiony right here, like a little bit, which is nice, because usually these kind of sandals have no cushion on them. Okay, I have these shorts on. you can tell <laughs> they're way way too tight they're cute they really are cute but they are so tight the pockets are pulling apart and if I sit down I'd probably rip them <laughs> So what do you think of this? I think it's cute. It's really fun, right? And I like how on the back, it's open. It's like suspenders on the back. I like that. Because like I said, I live in the desert. It gets super hot. I don't want jeans going all the way up my back. But it is. It's very fun and playful. <laughs> it feels like something I could go anywhere in like if we went to a park or we went hiking or we had to paint something or go for a day trip somewhere it just feels like you could wear it anywhere This is very comfortable. I, I was telling Brad, I feel like I'm wearing pajamas, but I'm kind of okay with that because what's wrong with being comfortable? Nothing, literally nothing. I mean, it's super casual and fun, but it just feels like, once again, something that could be worn for a bunch of different fun, casual events. A day trip in the car, a trip to the beach, This top, while I think it's cute, I don't know if it's for me. It feels like it's falling open on the bust. And hmm, I don't know, just kind of meh. What do you think? It's so flirty and fun, <sighs> pretty, love it. By the way, the shorts are mine, so <laughs> in case you're wondering why I didn't mention them, they're, um, they're my own. Well, this is fun. <laughs> Love this. I think it's so pretty. <laughs> this is a really good dress to get if you want to add more dimension to your body. If you want to make your waist look smaller, if you want to look more hourglass, this is definitely the dress for you. I love this dress, okay? <laughs> but I feel like I look like Ebenezer Scrooge. All I need is my nightcap hat. And 
a candle. <laughs> Candlestick with a candle. Yeah. <laughs> right? It does it it does not compute the way it did. Now and then I thought, well, maybe this ties in the front. I don't know why it goes on the inside though. I can't figure out. Is this See, then it looks weird back here. What do you think of this one? I'm kind of on the fence, uh, especially with back here, the way it bunches. Now, I could tighten the straps, but... <sighs> And here's the necklace. Oops, sorry. Get my other one out of the way. There you go. What did you think? Let me know. The sandals, they're not going to work. I couldn't even get my foot in them. Which sucks, because I really like them. I wanted them. I'm going to see if they have them in a wide. And if they do, I'll ask them to send me a wide pair because I really, really like them. They're so cute. I feel like they're really versatile and I need sandals. And I think the price is quite reasonable. A wise person once told me, never scrimp on shoes, always get good shoes. And I agree. I have some cheap shoes and I hate them. I always end up wearing the nicer shoes more often. Not only do they look better, but they're so much more comfortable. So to me, some people might be watching this going, $60 for a pair of sandals? Yeah. <laughs> yep, if they're comfortable, they're going to be worth it. This necklace, I really like it. I don't know how I feel about $28. If it's on sale, I'll buy it. I have, Of course, I have to go look at the app to find out, and you're on my phone. But um, the shorts, definitely no. The sandals, no. The tank dress, I, I do really like this, but I just saw the price. Is that correct? Yeah. $50 for this? No. I'll just get one of the... I mean, you can go on Amazon or Walmart and find a t-shirt dress for $20 or less. So I think I'm just going to do that. I do really like it, but not for that price. This palm tie front dress, I really like this. And I think for what it is, it's a good price. It's comfortable. It fits beautifully. It looks like it was made for me. The quality is there. So this one is definitely on my radar to possibly keep. The striped linen dress. I did. I look like Ebenezer Scrooge in it. So that's a definite no for me. Uh, the wrap blouse. I liked it okay, but I didn't like how it kept falling open. And I didn't like that it's not machine washable. That's just killed it right there. The dress I'm wearing right now, I'm kind of, it's okay. I, I don't love it, but I don't dislike it. I think it's cute, but it's a hundred dollars. So I'm probably not going to keep it. I think that it is worth it to spend a hundred dollars on a dress. Some people might argue with me, but I think that with the way that dresses are tailored, it is worth spending more on dresses than maybe a t-shirt or shorts or something like that. If they're made right and they fit you right, it's worth the money and dresses depending on what you get if you don't get something that's real trendy it's going to be timeless whereas a t-shirt shorts that kind of stuff you tend to kind of go through each year and have to get rid of and that kind of thing so I, 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 I am more willing to spend more money on a dress but only if I love it the 90s short overalls I'm going to have to really think about those ones because I loved them. And Brad really liked them on me too. So, right? And then the last thing on my list here is that V-neck camisole top. It's $39. Um, I have a couple V-neck camisole tops in other colors and prints. And they're usually anywhere from $40 to $60. So I, I think $39 is a reasonable price. I'm not... Um, I don't have a problem with that. 
So let me know what you thought. If you were me, what would you keep? What did you love? Did you like any of it? I don't know. Let me know. <laughs> also, let me know if you have any of these items. Are they comfortable? Do you like them? It's, it's always nice to hear feedback from you guys about what you think about different brands and if they're comfortable and if they last long and that kind of thing. So definitely, definitely let me know. These are, since I just started getting Trunk Club, these are newer brands for me. I'm not real aware of them. I don't know what I think of them yet. So I would really love your input. If you're interested in trying Trunk Club, be sure to click on the description box down below. I have a link for you. If you use that link, you, you and I both get a discount. You get a discount on your first box and I get a discount on my next box. Thank you so much for watching. I love you. Bye. Thank you.